and Firth on the agenda. Shots. Oh, man. What's good? What's happening, guys? Gentlemen, Rob, how are you doing out there? I'm doing good. Yeah. yeah. All right. Well, all right. <laughs> <laughs> and that's our show, folks. They're like, Rob's all right. <laughs> Be sure to check the links at the below. Uh, like, subscribe, follow. Catch us next week. We'll see you out. Uh, what about you, Danny? How you doing? Oh, man, I don't think you want to know about my week. It was bad. I, I wasn't. I, I had a. I had a week of not feeling well, so it was uh, no good. No bueno. Josh, sir, how you doing? <clears throat> Like Danny, I'm doing okay. Uh, just dealing with some family <laughs> shit, but just just life. But not as bad as Danny. I'm doing okay. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, uh, I'm doing all right. I got to go to a concert this past Friday at the Observatory in Santa Ana. I saw Wolf and Bear, um, Royal Coda, and a band called uh, Idola. And all three of them fucking ripped, man. It was such a good show. It was awesome. Yeah. Uh, a lot of the, I was telling Danny, a lot, of, a lot of the members are like some of them are sprinkled out through all three bands. So like, they all tour together because some of some members, like like with you, Josh, how you're a drummer in two different bands, where we play shows sometimes. Like, yeah, but yeah, man, that was cool. That was really, it was awesome. It was the last show on the leg of their tour that they were doing. So, yeah, oh yeah, but they sounded amazing. Yeah, hell yeah, they did. Yeah. Have you guys been to the observatory in Santa Ana? No, oh, that's yeah. what I was gonna say I've never been there. It's yeah. probably it's been a long time since I've been there. Yeah, it's it's got a weird layout, but I I enjoy the sound. It sounds awesome there. Um, it's got like a it's all standing room, but it has like three three tiers. So it's like the bowl, and then it goes to like a wall in a U shape, and then it goes a step up, and then another step up, and like people stand there in those sections too. So, so but it's like an out. It's like an outdoor version of the Palladium. Then that's a good way to put oh. it. Like oh, as no. far as the one more time, Rob. You think it's like the Palladium? No, like an outdoor version, meaning like it's standing only, and then the second tier is standing. Like how there's multiple floors, but there isn't necessarily seats on any of the floors. Yeah, yeah. like that. Yeah, I would. Yeah, it's kind of like the Fox Theater. Yeah, it was cool. So yeah, Rob, what are we getting into today? Today we are going to do, most likely, we came up with a couple of uh, off-the-wall, most likely questions, and uh, we're going to each pitch our answer of which member of this band would most likely fit that question, and uh, have a little discussion, a few laughs, maybe a couple more drinks, who knows where it goes from here. Let's go. Uh, uh, forewarning you guys, are we including Dustin or just the four of us? Hey, that, let's include Dustin. I, no, we can include Dustin, that's fine. Game. Over time? I say he's fair game. Oh, yeah, 100%. Right. Let's go. First question. Dustin. I don't have the questions. Oh, I thought you were reading okay. one off, bro. I thought you no, were going to no, read it, bro. I didn't get the printout. <laughs> I was like, what's going on? All right, all right, all right. I'll, I'll do a couple. All right. First question. Who is most likely to get arrested? Ooh, that's a good one. All right. So, gentlemen, we're, we have signs that we're holding up here. Danny, what did you put on yours? No, you couldn't see it. No, I did. <laughs> yeah, Danny says Danny. Rob I said Rob. Rob. I'm saying Rob. <laughs> and what did you say, Rob? I didn't see it. Rob? <laughs> So Danny and Rob are the only dudes to pick themselves. I like that. Don't 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 get me wrong. Like I was gonna put Danny, uh, <laughs> but I feel like Danny is only just for the angry. Is why Danny would get arrested. Yeah, because <laughs> Danny's a fun. If Danny's having fun while he's drinking, ain't nobody calling the cops. Like the cops are probably drinking with Danny already. <laughs> but if angry Danny, that's the only time. Like. I'm like, oh yeah, we're probably gonna run into more angry Danny on the road <laughs> down the line than anything. So, okay, could be fun. Second part to that question and honesty. Out of the band members, who has been arrested? 
<laughs> me. <laughs> um, me. We don't know what though, right? Uh, so both of you guys, I've never been arrested. I've been pulled over once, and that was it. Try being white, is that what you said? Yep. <laughs> you don't know what it's like, man. You don't even know what the struggle, man. The struggle's real. <laughs> Having to do your white boys. Good Holy evening, shit. how are you doing today? <laughs> Here is my license and registration. Now, I've, I've been in the car with others as they've been pulled over as well, but I've never been arrested. And, uh, like, the cops actually pulling me over with me driving once. So, <clears throat> yeah. Crazy. Are we are right. we We're talking right. about what what we got arrested for at all, or are we getting away from that? We can, that? Like, we can move we on. Really we we can oh move on. <laughs> I didn't know exactly how deep we wanted to go there. I was like, it's like all right. I was just asking a part B. We don't gotta go to C. We're good. Okay. Next I got, question. I got, some, I got some. I got some good stories about it, but you know, if we're not going there, we're not going there. Well, that could be a Patreon episode. Okay, yeah. next question. Who is most likely to give to charity? Hey, I say Danny. I'm going with Danny. Danny's going with Dustin. What's the what's the cricket uh say? What do they say? <laughs> what's the cricket in the background say? <laughs> By the way, guys, that's not Dustin in the background. That's a, a cricket. That's <laughs> those big ass Texas crickets. <laughs> yeah. Um Honestly, to be honest, if I were to give an honest answer, I would say just knowing all of us, I would say all of us. Like, but as far as like most likely to, uh, I picked you, Danny, just because uh, you're so handsome. You know. Cricket says chirp, 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 chirp. That's the cricket's note. Yeah. Let, uh, you want to hit the next question? Yeah. <laughs> all right. Um, who is most likely? To become a millionaire. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go like this. And I'm going to fan them all out. <laughs> because if either one of you do it, it better be with me. So <laughs> <laughs> That's a good way to answer it. We'll go with Rob. Uh, Danny's going with Rob. Rob's going with Danny. I'm going with Dustin just because he has no kids. That, <laughs> that's a great answer. I'm thinking logically, like, hey, fuck, you got no kids, man. All you got to do is pay rent. Exactly. If he just pays that pay, she can reach it without even, like, needing to do anything special for it. He'll, he'll get there, saving the money. So <laughs> That was great. Fucking kids, man. <laughs> oh, man, speaking of which, mine's going to be 21 on the 17th. It's crazy. Uh, we're just having a little get-together at my mom's. He's not really big on the, uh, like, going outside around people. He doesn't like that. He would like it more if there was no people. Uh, oh, yeah, that's how the world works. <laughs> Alrighty, I'll read the next question. Here we go. Who is most likely to survive a zombie apocalypse? I'm going with Rob. All right, you, go, you go into your answer, Josh. Why, why Rob? Because Rob's going to eat the goddamn zombies. <laughs> <laughs> I said Danny. And the reason why is because I feel like he has an advantage out of all of us where he's kind of already got like all the, the high tech stuff here that he could set up to make a perimeter of his house. <laughs> and then I just wouldn't want to run into Danny, especially angry Danny. So, yeah, yeah. but I don't I don't win on the, uh, the in the cardio game. You know what I'm saying? That's, that's <laughs> the problem. I think, how, I many, think how many zombies you're, you're, you're swinging at? That's Danny, one, how many zombies gonna, you swinging at? That's going to tip the scales right there. You know <laughs> the cardio. What did you? What was your answer, Rob? Yeah, I've been preparing for it. You know, just zombie, waiting for it to happen. Zombie apocalypse weapon of choice. What do you got? Oh, by the way, Rob's answer was Rob because he didn't say it. He just held it. Oh, up. sorry, myself. Yeah. Uh, um, I'm, I, first of all, a machete, close range. Don't have to reload. I got the long arms. Make sure your arms are covered. Don't get bit. You know, it's like going to a buffet. Don't don't get bit. <laughs> don't get bit. Don't I just picture Rob bit. with two, just picture him with two machetes going ham as he got like a cigarette hanging out of his mouth and he's just fucking, <laughs> you know, just having a good old time. That's okay. Rob's going to kill all the zombies. Nothing's going to be left but him and that fucking cricket. 
So what are we doing tonight, Cricket? Chirp, 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 chirp. Here's a here's a really here's a really good one. Who is most likely to accidentally say something inappropriate on live air? That should be unanimous. <laughs> Rob. <laughs> Me, <laughs> I put me. Yeah, Rob, care to go into one? Numerous times. Yeah, I just think that it's oh. it's the obvious answer, and it's the best answer to be honest. You know, yeah, Yolo. Yeah. All right. Hang on. One second. Yeah, no problem. Wait. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Don't pay rent. Sorry about that. Oh, Damn man. neighbor. Got to get that guy house trained, dude. Especially if he's going to survive the apocalypse with you. <laughs> this motherfucker. Here's the next question. Who is most likely to win a Nobel Prize? Going with Danny. I'm going I'm going with Danny as well. Gosh. Go with Josh. Go with Josh. Well, thank you. Go with Josh oh. as well. Yeah. Well, I just I got a text, and, and, and du- I just got a text, and Dustin voted for me. So, all right, let's get it. Oh. <laughs> he, he proxied that in. Okay. <laughs> did Did you suggest it, and he hearted the comment? Is that yeah. how you? <laughs> I just said I'd win a Nobel Prize, right? And he just he, he's like, sure, he like sure, sure, <laughs> Oh shit. Uh, let's see. What's the next one? Uh, who is most likely to get lost in their own neighborhood? I'm gonna go with Rob because I feel like his neighborhood's still new to him, so I'm pretty sure Rob uh, would be the one to get lost. Over when this happens? That's a great. That's a great question. Tell you what. However, you usually drive, Josh. We'll put it like that. Hey, did we we didn't we didn't talk about the story about how I how I got arrested, right? <laughs> That's changing my vote now. I'm gonna go with oh. Danny then. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go with Danny too. I'm gonna go with Danny too. Stay good. You, I'm still yourself? Good. New to the area, man. It's That's what I'm sucks. saying. I'm giving it to Rob because he's new in the neighborhood. Damn you know, Google I've lived in the same. I've lived in the driver. same city for like, like nine years now or something like that, and I still don't know my way around town. If it's not like in my normal route to work and back, I'm like, how do I See, get there? If it said on tour, who would get lost on tour? I'm definitely picking you. But yeah. in their hometown, I figured you guys got the advantage having years on me, you know? Not me, dude. I'm the worst. <laughs> oh, man. Josh, you want to hit the next question? Next question. Who is most likely to forget an important date like an anniversary or birthday? Myself. I'm going with Dustin. I'm going with Dustin. <laughs> I'm going with me. Where you, Rob? Me? Go for, <laughs> for Mark. Yeah. Honestly, like, if it wasn't for Facebook or Instagram, I wouldn't know anybody's birthday. Like, because they're always like, oh, so-and-so's birthday today. So then I give my, I shoot my cousin a text. Hey, yo, happy birthday. And they're like, oh, thanks, man. I can't believe you remember it. I'm like, yeah, of course. You know? Fucking. Yeah, that's, that's, that's exactly yeah, what happened. Yeah. <laughs> exactly what happened <laughs> yeah. let's see yeah Next go for question. it he's looking right at me too I'm going with Rob I'm going with Dustin I, I'm going to say Rob not me I got allergies <laughs> what's it say what's it say Rob my stupid ass oh you're <laughs> oh yeah I can barely I- handle living with one cat because of my allergies and I did it for my kid clear it in yes. all the time there's a good one. Who is most likely to become a viral internet meme? I'm going to say Mark. <laughs> yeah. That's I'm going with one. Rob. I'm going, I'm going, going, with, I'm Rob. going with Mark. <laughs> Rob. I'm going to go with Mark. Why is that, Rob? This one. Just mainly because he handles the social media accounts of ours already. That's so, why I was yeah. going with it. But but you the know, per- the percentage is definitely way higher for me. That you're right. The percentage is definitely that, way that higher sock, for me. That sock video might do it, though. You never know. Yeah, I was gonna say. Although, if you uh, did more videos, I think that even though they would be fewer than what I've done, that you would be most likely to go viral before me. Let's hope not, right? <laughs> <laughs> then it's contagious, and we're all in one bus. Ugh, it's gross, right? Yeah. All right, guys. 
Who is most likely to write a best-selling novel? I'm going with Danny. I'm going to say me. I'm going to put myself. There you go. Doogie. <laughs> Don't look Danny. Danny. Just because fucking he's already Trump. working on it. Just fucking. <laughs> oh, yeah. This could come yeah. up with a, a great book. Uh, well, probably the only guy that's written one. I barely read one. Well, Honestly, novel. Danny. I really do think that you should write a book about your life at one point, dude, because you've had quite an eventful one, just based off the stories you've told me and the things that you've done and the people you've worked with and stuff. It would be a great read. Yeah. We'll see. Maybe. Maybe one day. We'll talk to the cricket and see if we can make that happen. He's uh, he's like, yeah, whatever. Everything's got got to run through the cricket at this point. So (laughs) So good. Awesome. (laughs) Good. All right. There we go. Who is most likely to start a new trend? Cricket slapping. God damn it. I think Rob just I think Rob just did it right now. Cricket slapping. Right now. The new trend. Who's you more know? likely to start a new trend? Yeah. yeah. I said myself. I buy that. Like I said, I think Rob just did one with the cricket slapping. What was your guys' answer? I'm going with Danny. I said okay. Rob. I picked Rob. All right, all right, cool, cool, cool. I think it's. I think Danny's gonna set a new trend with how to do music. There you go. How to you know what tones to play with and everything like that. Uh, it, I mean, like what the heartfelt message we got from uh, our mixer. Uh, you know that most of that credit goes to Danny. You know. Yeah. So. Honestly, uh, I think the way, if you like the way our music sounds and like some of the way stuff's coming across, you got to thank this man, you know? Yes, sir. I think that trend might set. Hell yeah. Uh, hit the next question, Josh. If you got him right there. Right. Who is most likely to move to another country? Can you read all of these? Yeah. Oh, I like your, I, I like your thinking, Danny. I like it. I like your thinking, Danny. That's what's up. And why? And why did you? And why did you pick all of us, Danny? Because we should just get a goddamn island. You know what I'm saying? Uh, <laughs> all except Dustin. all except Dustin. That's funny. We like when people finally got their land back. <laughs> oh shit! You guys all get hey, on him. Get on him, man. You know. Who is most likely to eat something weird just to prove they can? I don't know. I'm going to say Danny. I'm going to say Danny because the way he would eat pineapple on pizza in front of us just because somebody told him not to shows me (laughs) he's willing to do anything. Hey, I'm going to tell you right now, though, I'm not going to count this guy out right here, Dustin. Dustin? I think I think You're probably I'm gonna tell yeah. you right now, I think I think he's got some fight in him. I think even even if I came at him, he would he would he would bring yeah. it, you uh, know? I'll I'll give him a chance. I'll go with you because I'm kinda limited on the fact that I don't eat meat. Mm. Otherwise I'm adventurous, I'll try it, but because it's if it's got meat in it, nah. So I'm kinda not <laughs> in the game. And that's where I come in. There you go. <laughs> right. meat. Yeah. Rob, weirdest thing I'll that you put in your mouth. Go. Oh boy! Oh, one like, pack like, of hot dogs. What was that? <laughs> one pack of hot dogs. One pack of hot dogs at the same time? No, one at a time in a bun covered with chili and mustard. <laughs> Just fucking tackle the pack of glizzies. That's crazy. You put a pack of glizzies. <laughs> um, next one. <clears throat> Who is most likely to drop everything and travel the world? I'm gonna go, with Dustin. Oh. I think I think again he doesn't have kids, so. Yep, yep, yeah. that's the same thinking. That's my answer too. He's just watching this, laughing on top of his pile of money he has. Look at that. He's like, he's like, <laughs> you guys with your kids. <laughs> oh shit! I don't know where we're at on this list. Where are we at? I get the next one. All right, go for it. Who is most likely to accidentally reveal a big secret? Mm-hmm. No Dustin that well, so I can't pick him by default. I'm gonna claim I'm gonna call myself on this one. Okay. <laughs> okay. I said oh, Rob. Mark, Mark. Mark does make a lot of sense for me. because again, the social media stuff. That's uh, <laughs> that's I what I'm like saying. More, more opportunities. True, uh, true. 
teaser trailer for songs that had yet to drop in months in advance. Speaking of uh, big secrets, didn't we <laughs> just, uh, I think, solidify what day we're releasing Little Karma? We have, sir. August 9th. August 9th will be the official release date for Little Karma. So, you guys, get ready for that. I'm sure you get sick of me posting teasers about it, but here we go, you know? <clears throat> yeah. What's he going to say? Uh, where are we at? Where are we at? Uh, Who is most likely to join a reality TV show? Is, is Dustin just the default answer for things we, we got to do without ki- with, with our kids? <laughs> without kids? No. I'm Rob. Nope. All righty. I'm gonna I think go Rob. Rob should have his own yeah, Rob. TV show already. Great. That's all I need is people following me around while I'm doing my shit all day. Slapping crickets and shit. We got the film crews <laughs> with Rob all day. It's just an uh, entire uh, episode of Rob oh, sitting there. Really? It's just an entire episode what? of you sitting there high as shit with like the cricket going on in the background and that's it. <laughs> what if he did that and then he started chirping slower though? Then you knew it was taking effect. That is true. Hey, do we got we got time for a couple more? I honestly don't know how long this episode's been going. Uh, let's keep it going. We're good. Yeah, All Thank right. You. Got a couple. Let's more. go. Hit it. Uh, who is most likely to stay up all night binge watching a series? Damn, I think, I think that's the whole band, bro. That. Yeah. I say I think that's yeah, all of us. Yeah, I would say that's all of us. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna go. Yeah. If I can hold up all five like you did, everybody. Oh, okay. <laughs> all five. All right, good. Yeah. yeah. Yep. All right, next one. Oh, boy. Who is most likely to win an argument? Ooh. Can I vote for the cricket? Yeah. Fuck no. <laughs> that guy doesn't last very long. So I'm not sure who would win it completely, but if I had to go down to a tie. Oh, see? Okay. I had said Rob. No, I'll end an argument, but I may not win it. <laughs> I'm gonna end it, but I may not win it. <laughs> I'm gonna go with Rob. I'm gonna go with Rob. I'll, I'll take it to extents and just be like, "All right, we're burning this bridge tonight. Let's do this." Yeah. <laughs> Who did you go with, Jack? That's, that's... With Dustin because he's never here for the argument, so he wins by default. Well, I don't know <laughs> if he wins, right? So to speak, yes. Let's see. Okay, where are we at? Where are we at? Okay, okay. Who is most likely to organize a surprise party? That sure as shit ain't me, because I don't like surprises. I <laughs> wanted when as you read that and I was looking at it, I wanted it to say who's most likely to organize a sausage party. That would have been the whole band. Who's more likely to organize band practice? <laughs> I said Rob. I went Danny. <laughs> That's it. Yeah, I don't know. I'll go with Danny. I'll go with Danny. Yeah. Cause... Oh, here's a really good one. Who is most likely to get an indecent exposure charge? Gentlemen, are we talking about why you guys got arrested? <laughs> but that's not me. That one's not me. That's that, not my story. That wasn't at all. me. That wasn't me either. Nothing indecent. No. <laughs> Property damage. Yes. I'm gonna say Dustin because I know what that dude's willing to do for a laugh. Like. <laughs> oh, that's what <laughs> I was take... about to say. He'll, he'll take that bet, dude. Like, I'm gonna, I'm it. gonna toss up between uh, Rob and Dustin on this one. That one's tough. <laughs> I feel you. I feel you. I think, I think, uh, I think, uh, on the road, it's gonna get pretty wild. I think it's gonna get fun. Pull over. I just got to piss right here. That's a part. Woo. <laughs> oh, yeah. And Josh, you said Dustin. Yeah. Yeah. Poor guy can't even fend for himself. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, who is most likely to forget their part during a live performance? Does part include lyrics? Yes. He's I. I'm going. I'm going with myself on this one. I'm going with myself. I pick Mark. Mark. We got two for Mark. One for me. What do you got, Rob? Me. <laughs> I can That's speak from lies. experience. That's all mine. Totally. <laughs> totally gonna be me. Oh, I could throw him <laughs> under the bus personally too. <laughs> oh man. I'll tell you what, had Jamie not been in the crowd singing the part that I was supposed to be in, I still wouldn't know where the hell I was in that song to today. So, <laughs> Yeah, we were in Texas, too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. But yeah, I don't know what it is, man. Sometimes I'll just, I'm like listening to the song and I'm like, why can't I remember how this song starts right now? You know, like, fuck. 
<clears throat> the worst is when you're about to go far. into the song. What's the there next question? Here we go. Who is most likely to crowd surf during a concert? The only one that can. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Josh. Yeah. Hopefully, somebody in the crowd is Josh. <laughs> Josh. This is really cloud, is. crowd surf, or you guys just fucking throwing me over there? <laughs> we'll see. Oh, shit. Oh, man. How many more do you guys want to do? Where are we at in time, Rob? I can't see it on my end. Uh, we could probably do two, like two, two more, you know? Yeah, let's do two or three more. Let's go. Uh, who is most likely to smash their instrument on stage? Rob. Yeah. The one who did it. Rob. The one who did it? Is that what you did? Yeah, the one who did it. What did you do, Danny? You know. Um, he said his guitar the would look better on the wall. He, so he tried to put it in the wall. Told you about the time I went to jail, right? <laughs> <laughs> Holy fuck. <laughs> no, I, uh, yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a good story. It's one of those, uh, there was lots and lots of alcohol. And, uh, yeah, it was just, Sounds you know. It sounds like we could make that story a Patreon exclusive, sir. For, yeah, yeah. <laughs> He's trying to pitch it through this episode. It's the best, this is the best advertisement for this fucking Patreon video. You <laughs> guys want to hear about me getting arrested? Not really. Okay, I'll wait till the next question. This fucking broke me. <laughs> oh, shit. That's uh, the cricket, bro. God yes. damn it. Here it goes again. Wait for it. Cricket's no. in there like this. Here's a good one. I'm kind of looking through the other ones really quick. Uh, it says, who is most likely to design the band's next album cover? Rob. Yes, yeah. Rob. <laughs> Rob. Rob. Rob's like, Rob goes, the cricket. Johnny, Johnny Chico. Chico. <laughs> yes. Hell yeah, dude. That's what's up. Uh, go ahead and pick a question there, Josh. Okay. Uh, last one. Well, okay. Keep going. It depends on how quickly blow through them. Who is most likely to come up with a crazy stage costume idea? Rob. Wow. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Hang on. Rob. What? Rob. Yeah, I feel like that was a, just a gimme one, but hang on. Look, let's. We got plenty of these. Let's read another one. Okay. Well, wait. I, I mean, I'm going to say you for sure because the costume you showed up to at that one show was pretty amazing. That's what it was I was pretty saying. dope. It was, tell you what, it was so dope. I kind of wanted it to be your thing every time we performed. Like, <laughs> I don't know, but that does look badass, man. Thank you. I think but, I think yeah. any time any time we open with Symphony of Chaos, that should be the the costume. Oh, now we're going to have. Costume changes during the set, and no, then right no, when the next song that hits, if that's the if that's the set we're playing off. that night, where where symphony's the song, then you're you got we got to do it. That's up. That's what's up. We'll see. God. All right. So then one more. Yeah, we got. It. We'll end it with a good one then. Who is most likely to get in a fight with a fan? Oh shit. Uh, I'm gonna go with Rob. I'm picking Danny. I'm gonna go with my boy Marty. Danny. With me, you'll <laughs> <laughs> be a female fan. We said, oh. "You okay?" Yeah. Thanks oh, everybody for watching the last episode of the Last Thing of the Warcast. Oh man, this that one does rock. Oh my god. <laughs> Holy shit! That's a good one, Rob. That was a good one. Uh, so, guys, any last things to say about anything coming up that or that we wanted to get up, talk about really quick? Anybody? Uh, 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 One more time. August 9th. August Little 9th. Karma. August 9th. Little Karma. Little Karma will be dropping, guys, August 9th. Keep a look out on our socials. We will be posting pre-save links like we always do. And we appreciate when you guys do that. It really helps the algorithm and it really helps it get pushed to other people on Spotify and every, everywhere else it's listened to. So that is like a really simple, quick step to help tremendously, trust me. Uh, other than that, 
you know, we got the merch, we got the links, we got everything else, we got it all in the bio, give it a check, and we will catch you next week. Me, get out.